Now, I'm no barrister, but I think such a statement would carry more weight if Bigby weren't the only one to whom Georgie spoke. Especially given Bigby's history. What are you talking about? Don't bring up my past. Snow? And what about your history? All you've done to this fucking Yeah, man. motherfucker! What don't do bring this up, don't no pin evidence. this on me. Maybe, maybe he's... I mean, this doesn't feel right, how we're doing this. Oh, oh fucking beauty, shut right. the fuck up. This man tormented all of you, for profit! Georgie Let killed him. Let me just make sure I understand you. You're trying to say that I'm responsible I should have for what fucking George killed did, him. Because he was working Fuck for Fuck's sake. Yes. Yes. Of course. Yes. You're responsible. Well, by that logic, Miss White should be on trial for Tweedledum's murder. Since you know Bigby works for her. That's... He killed a man. That don't make him a murderer. What happened with Tweedledum wasn't... Even the fucking two pricks I had, had shotguns. I was... Me. Fuck you. you nothing to do with it. Bigby and I have already discussed his behavior that night. We're handling it internally. Now, I, heard that before? I fucking it's self-defense, motherfucker. The poor when Section he one, paragraph, him. motherfucking four. Anyone getting assaulted, shot at, can have a right to defend themselves, motherfucker. Did you think we'd all just let that go? Snow had nothing to do. I didn't hear that. We all thought she was dead. Besides, dead. Who's Crane dead? was still deputy mayor when that happened. Right before you decided to kidnap him. It was for his own Ooh, protection. Oh, bitch, yeah, you tell him. Oh, you're right, dear. Crane was in charge. Sometimes it's hard to tell the difference. That's enough. So, you're yeah, that's your that's enough, big boy. Behavior, but I must perish for This mine. is completely different. I we all... did not order those two girls dead. It simply never happened. Georgie killed Faith and Lily. End of story. They want Can I push him down that fucking well? But they refuse to answer for their own this crimes. This isn't right. Oh, please. This isn't the point. We'll deal with them after we deal with you. <laughs> Everyone just shut the fuck up. I mean, a certain level of privilege should be afforded to them. This is how it's always yes. been. See, this is exactly to what I'm speaking. We lashed our ropes to this diseased world. And ever since, which one of us has been there for you? Who filled your lives with the promise of more? Who was there while they idly played in their towers? Judging you, treating you as mindless children, too stupid to command your own destiny. Without me, who will pay your rent when you're on the verge of eviction? Who Motherfucker. will challenge their brutality when it leaks to our dear citizens? Oh, I'm gonna who push this, I swear to God, I will rip this cunt. Oh shit, I can't, I can't, I need to stop who saying that word. I will rip it off his head. Oh. Excuse me. I, She's... I wanted to make sure I had the chance to say something. Why don't you take a I, I thought she died. What's she doing here? I'd like to... I, I need to say something. We're... Oh, she can't say... Something. She has something to say and we're gonna listen. She can't Go say ahead. anything. You probably don't remember me. I don't know why I was afraid to come My here. Dear, I don't Just shut you... up. You insane oh, us motherfucker. for years. Let us hear stories about what you do. Told us we would lose everything if we stepped just one toe out of line. And we couldn't say a word about it because of these damn ribbons. <sighs> but you know what? Now it's my turn to talk. How are you? I found Vivian's body. Did you kill her? Did he? Sheriff, this is highly irregular. Be quiet. We need to establish some order here. I'm going to tell the truth from this one here. Hold herself. Back at the pudding and pie. I'm sorry, um, I don't think I Nerissa. My name is Nerissa. It's okay, my dear. Bitch, you tell him. He ordered them dead. This fucker. Faith and Lily. That's a lie. I was in the goddamn room when he did it. Faith and Lily are dead because of you. The only two people who ever gave a damn about me. And justice. Whoa! Be solved. He made I'm so I'm so fucking loud. Always him. You're winning the crowd. You would have never done anything without his say so, ever. You're going to take. I'm probably gonna watch this back in like At your ears are fucking getting burned. me up on this. We all heard you say it. Did you now? Looks like we found our evidence. She saw it firsthand. He's guilty. Good enough for me. Guilty. Me guilty. 
you so take my right? fa fucker. Yeah, witching well. No, that's too fucking easy for a crook like that. What do you mean? He's gotta pay for what he did. Listen to yourselves. You're all rats, fleeing from one sinking ship to the next. So quick to latch onto whatever will keep your miserable lives afloat. This is how you want to repay all I've done for you. What? You take oh, two people's you. lives away and now you want mercy? I could always I will rip you apart. Would you enjoy that? <laughs> well done then. Now for your sentence. We don't have to become murderers. What are you talking about? He's guilty. I know that, but we don't have to kill anybody. We can imprison I don't him. care. I'll do the blame. I'll take the blame. We can never hurt anyone again. How can we be sure he won't escape? I can help. We'll use magic. That's I not good him. enough. Maybe there will be more if he isn't hasn't stopped. Been enough I don't care. So we get rid of him. Get him out of here. We can send him Everyone, away. What do I do? Listen up. Clearly, yeah, listen we're up. We're having trouble agreeing on a suitable punishment. So I think this we... This is going nowhere. Someone needs to make a decision. Who? I hope you aren't suggesting your... I'm making the call. Well, I'm making the call. Why should you... He is the only officially appointed representative here. Right. <gasps> oh! Shots fired. I guess it does. Okay. Fine. Are you sure? I this know. That's what the people want, Miss White. Okay. Yeah, Mr. fuck you, Miss White. It's your call. Snow. Just down the do witching well. Right. Down the witching well. Down the witching well. Yes, Sheriff. Rip his head off from down. Think is right. Teach him a oh, fucking lesson. Nah. No. He has to die. Rip his head off. I can get rid of him. Not this way. No! I think it's I think it's a fucking choice. <laughs> Hold on, no, 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 I didn't get the fucking cheese. There you are. I hope you all remember this moment. Think of me when you try to sleep. You know, between us, I was gonna let you live. But now, you're going to miss me. No, I won't. Sheriff. Oh my god. Oh. Off of his head! I don't know what you will. <laughs> oh my fucking god. <laughs> oh ha <laughs> For Lily and Faith. Fail Town is afraid yes. of Big B Wolf. Another one of us to erase from the books. Oh shit. I got a fucking say. I fucking I didn't suspect. I thought they wanted me to kill him. They wanted what they want. Yeah, and that was just fucking brilliant. Off of his head, like hey, I'm, so, I'm so fucking energetic this episode. You need to come see the truck off. We're leaving for the farm in a few. Thought you might want to. Well, I don't know. I'll be down in a minute. Okay. Oh, so right. that, that's the guy who worked with the Tweedledees, and we gave him a job, which is very good on us. This fucking line. That's Grant Rapunzel. That's Jack. Remember Jack? I think I would like. Is everyone afraid of me? Oh, uh, Mr. Wolf, Flycatcher left his keys. I think sh she's not happy with me. I'm sorry about what happened with the crooked man. I didn't. I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm fucking sorry, sorry. Sheriff. I have to take care of this. So we'll talk later, okay? So I can't... Does this mean I cannot fuck Snow White anymore? Good morning, Miss White. You're late. Are you fucking with me? I'm sorry, but you wanted me to kill him. I like, I want to rip off his head, because come on. I'm gonna see you, Colin. <laughs> Just winks at me. <laughs> I love Colin. 
So, like, it's really true then. Everyone is actually scared of me. But I gotta say, though, like, what a fucking way to end off a brilliant fucking game. And also, I'm just gonna say, I cannot wait for season two. Um, it has been confirmed, it's coming out next month. I cannot fucking wait. Um, so, wait out for that one until I'll see you. Carry me for fuck's sake, I don't give a shit. We got these. Oh, thank you. It's uh, been pretty busy around here. Morning, Sheriff. Nice fucking Oh, I'll tell you, don't be pissed. Nice fucking <laughs> oh, Shit. Just go grab that, would you? Sorry about all this. Uh, I tried to help. Just why the hell did she have to send me and me boy away, huh? You promised me okay. I'll get another chance. But Miss White said I had to go up to the damn farm anyway. Wait, Sheriff Bigby, I have something. <laughs> what uh, you got, son? What you got, son? You. Night, poor kid. Can you give this to Miss White, please? Dad says there's oh, no well, time kids. to say goodbye. So, if you could bring it to her. Yeah. Oh, you cannot say no to a kid, man. With me, and she said she liked that one the best. It's a willow beetle. That's a big one. They're cool, cause when they're little, they're <laughs> That's a weird gift. She'll love it, man. Yeah. That is a definition of a cutie. She said it was pretty. We're about ready to head out. What's it like at the farm? I've heard ogres live there, and, and they eat people in their sleep sometimes. God, I hope not. Do we have to go? I want to stay here. Well, we don't have a choice anymore. I'm sorry, TJ. Oh, no. Uh, look on the bright side, okay? There's plenty of space to run around. I wish. No, you're fucking sitting in my fucking apartment. You can swim all you want. Even in daytime? Yeah. Hey, even in daytime, buddy. Monday, seeing you. It'll be nice. <laughs> Come on. It won't be so bad. Have you been there before? No. I'm, uh... Some of the animals aren't comfortable around wolves. So you wouldn't, <laughs> would you? Oh, well, come on, I'm trying to be nice to the kid. Bye, Mr. Wolf. Goodbye, TJ. Bye, TJ. Hey, Big B. Where's your friend, Colin? Where's a fucking pig? How should I know? Bye, Toad. Bye, TJ. Oh, fucking everyone's leaving. Why is everyone leaving, man? Oh, I, f I feel so torn. You know. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Hi. So now she can speak. Oh. Yeah. I guess I am. It's not <laughs> easy to forget. I know it seems like I should be able to. It's just need to let that go. How are you going to move on? I don't want to remove it just in case I kill her. I know you're trying to help. But this is just something I need to do on my own. Fuck it. I, I feel Listen, upset now that I, everyone's I came here because leaving me. Toe, to TJ, never going to see their faces anymore. What is it? Snow White's just being a it's prick. Where the fuck's Crane? Not you know. Sure to start. And Narissa. <sighs> Even Georgie Faith and Vivian are fucking gone. Plan. We're gonna find a way out. Leave the pudding and pie for good. But then good. Faith decided to get some leverage. She stole a picture of Crane and Lily together. The minute Faith stole that photo, we had dirt on one of the crooked man's allies. If he found out, I I had no choice. You have to understand. You've I understand. Seen they kept us quiet in that place. Can you imagine the lengths they go just it's to okay. someone who had Like, as I was saying, this is a brilliant, like, okay. fucking... Like, if you're looking at this, okay. go fucking buy this game. I thought if I came clean to Georgie, he'd get the crooked man to leave us alone. We could just forget the whole thing. Maybe try again in a few years. You what? So I you told him everything. And I begged for mercy for all of us. 
I didn't want anyone to die over a picture. You were just trying to protect them. Yeah. Georgie promised he'd smooth things over with the crooked man. But then... Oh, God. <laughs> I'm gonna touch her. I just the way I just said I'm just gonna touch you. <laughs> I don't know what happened, but that night at the club, Georgie came back and told me things had changed. He had to make an example of us. We had committed treason. And while the two of us were sitting there as he was telling me this, Faith walked in, and I had to watch uh, while Georgie. Wait. So Georgie told you all this, not the crooked man. Back at the well, you said. I know what I said. But it wasn't the truth, was it? What does it matter? I know the crooked man did it. I fucking like hate the crooked man. Anyway. It was true enough. It was for the best. I guess, I guess it worked out in the end. <laughs> I guess it worked out then. Ripped off the. No, to be honest, right? He did strangle me. So like, I was gonna let. I was. I did say I was gonna let him live, but you know me. I'm a nice guy. After. I ripped the bastard out of. After faith. Oh. I tried to warn Lily. But she wasn't with her scheduled appointment. So I did the only thing I could do. I... I left Faith's head at your doorstep. You? Hey. I walked her over here. And I left her. You were trying to get my attention. So you no! Big B! Just grab her! Hold her! I just... pointed you in the right direction. <clears throat> People like us get forgotten all the time. The crooked I man fucking is like. On that. I would never forget you, man. When we man. Suffer, <laughs> I would never forget we you. Do it in silence, and the world likes it that way. We just fade, like we never. I'm just like, see if anyone just came through the door. I couldn't watch that happen to Faith or Lily. Nobody cares about us. I'm sorry, Narissa. I'm sorry that's what it took to get me to pay attention. See, there's people time. like this. She yeah, likes me. Right. But people yeah, who did right. like you and you did something wrong, those she are the kind of friends or people you just, just want to fucking avoid in your avoid right. in your life and I got I itchy balls. Win with these people. And also no, for the people who that saw that me that earlier, I was like, shit, yes I was in my boxes. You got problems. You two make a good team. The way you look out for each other and look out for us. I just no one's ever fucking happy. I do my job. I put my life on the line. I get shot at. I do what has to be done for them. But at the end of the day, I'm still the bad guy. I know. But they'll come around. You'll see. After everything you've done for us, maybe they don't want to admit it, but without you, none of this would have happened. You listened when no one else would. Ah, oh, she's such a fucking cutie. The cost, and you brought justice to this town. Finally, because you. I'm the justice bringer. What the dong of the bong? Saw who he really was. So from where I'm standing, you did the right thing. Thank you, you very, thank you very much, babe. Reason, and I left. I sound really fucking weird, calling a character. If anyone stood a chance against the crooked man, it was you. <laughs> None of it matters. I hope, I hope I'm doing good here. You've the rest of will remember that. Place. For better or worse, Fable Town wouldn't be the same without you. This girl. This girl. <laughs> Goodbye, You're Narissa. not as bad as everyone says you are. As he watch, watches that me. booty walk off. Trying to place me. You like my ribbon? Do you like it? Faith wore one too. Would hide her beauty so she could escape his kingdom. They used to call me the Little Mermaid. Did Dr. Swinehart ever get back to you about Faith? He said he wanted to run more tests. I hope you find what you're looking for. Go after. I'll see you. Not that disco. Wolf. Are you fucking with me? You ended there. Ah, you tell us how you bastards. But as I was saying, I cannot wait for season two because that just leads it off to there is going to be another season, as I said earlier. But guys, that was a fucking episode. This fucking 
like episode, well, f- fucking recording, whatever video deserves 15 likes. I cannot stress like this. Ah, uh, mate, this is fucking brilliant. You know. Ah, uh, fucking what a brilliant way to end a fucking brilliant game. So, guys, hope you enjoyed. Um, we're just gonna have a look at the statistics here. What did you do to Georgie? I'm sad I killed Georgie. Um, fucking uh, glad. Of... Oh, so only 40% of players ripped his head off. Why? Fucking just ripped the prick's head off. Did you give the cricket man a trial? Yeah? Yes, I did. I fucking. The 1.5% of people who did it. You people are pricks. Come on, you can't turn that down. Oh. Fucking, I wish I had more. So, guys, as I was saying, hope you enjoyed. I'll see you through the window whilst you're on the 